boy, do I love me some drama. Ever since I left Twitter, life just hasn't been the same. You know, I, I don't get as many hate, as much backlash. I love to clown people. I like to mess with people. I like to troll people. I like... <laughs> You could say I am not like most guys. I am pretty quirky, if you will. So I was just browsing YouTube. I was just watching some YouTube videos. And this video came out by this small YouTuber that I highly recommend. I thought it was a really, really well done video. And then this video got recommended to me by the one, the only, Jaden. And it had my profile picture. It had me on the thumbnail. So I was like, um, what did I do this time? I'm not on Twitter. I haven't been on Twitter, oh my God, in months. So I watched the video and there's some things that I want to address because I know some people, you know, call me a snake or, you know, you're fake or you're a fake person so i just want to address everything regarding this Jaden drama and i just love drama <laughs> it's fun i try and keep this channel as professional as possible which is why people get confused when they see me on twitter that is a very um unique tweet if you will <laughs> i don't get this why do people pretend to be nice or wholesome or like the most humble amazing person you're ever going to meet but behind the scenes they're weird or they have some weird fetish or they smell bad or they have some dark secret or they're like little kids is it really that hard just to be yourself it's like you're almost putting on a mask pretending to be who you are in all seriousness just be yourself saying whatever I want, making jokes I'd never feel comfortable making on YouTube. That's because I've always seen my YouTube and social media presence as separate. When do you talk about me? This was a kind of hero and inspiration to me. So just imagine if your favorite actor, sports player, called you out on Twitter. A lot of people wouldn't be able to handle that, but that doesn't at all excuse my actions or the things that I said to sensitive society. Most people don't have the full context. So the reason why, <laughs> the reason why Jaden told me to end my life to commit whole lot of red track three is because i clown on him so when this person was having some kind of meltdown or you know try to come at me or said something dumb i said something dumb back and then Jaden replied to me saying kill yourself and i found that extremely funny like i will never see a comment like this or a tweet or a comment that says sensitive the worst youtuber on planet earth this guy sucks major balls he's not funny kill yourself mean comments hate comments whatever you want to call them they do not affect me one bit if you take the internet this seriously if this if a tweet like this makes you want to end your life or makes you sad or depressed or ruin your whole day, maybe the internet isn't for you. And I am not trying to put this false. I'm a tough guy. I'm a badass. I never cry. I cry. I don't know why people needed to know that, but yes, I do have feelings. But this is the internet. Legitimately, don't take hate comments or videos that people make on me seriously. I like to respond to them because number one, that's content. Number two, it's fun. I do not dislike Jaden for telling me this. This did not offend me. This did not bother me, trigger me. Some Sensitive was one of the first friends that I made in the commentary community, and when I saw that he was celebrating what had happened, I just kind of snapped. You know, I, I thought this guy was my friend, but according to him, he never even liked me in the first place. Here we have another tweet that doesn't have the full context. In short, Jaden on Twitter was acting like a little bitch. Like, this person was crying non-stop 24-7. The reason why I said this... <laughs> She, him, don't care. He's still a little bitch who I never liked. The reason why I said this, I mean, there's a few reasons. I'll give you the first one. I was super annoyed by some of the tweets he's been having. Like, have you guys ever had a friend and they just keep getting more annoying and annoying and annoying and annoying? You're like, bro, come on. I'm starting not to like you. Well, that's what happened with Jaden. I was cool with this person. As time went on and they got bigger, like their ego got bigger. And am I saying that I don't have an ego? I do have an ego. But this person thought he ruled the fucking planet. Yeah, dude, I used to like you. I thought we were cool. But now you're just an annoying bitch. No one cares about your numbers. No one cares about the money you're making or your subscribers or views, whatever. And stop bitching and crying every two seconds. I was just getting pissed off because it was tweet after tweet after tweet after tweet. It was like, bitch, shut the fuck up. Just shut the fuck up, please. I am begging you. I will pay you a thousand dollars to stop tweeting for an hour. The reason why I'm saying this is because i was extremely pissed i was just tired and tired of the complaining i was just done i was just like you know what fuck this person fuck this guy girl whatever i am done since we're telling the truth here and it's and it's honest hours here i do apologize for saying i never liked them you know i thought he was cool he was always cool with me until this point commentary community and when i saw that he was celebrating what had happened i just kind of snapped you know i i thought this guy was my friend but according to him he never even liked me in the first place and that was pretty hard to deal with now i do want to make it clear that sensitive and i have cleared things up in private and have moved on completely from this situation but i still shouldn't have said what i did and that was completely uncalled for now after everything that had happened you would expect me to learn from all of my mistakes it's not like i'm going to bed every single night and i'm like dear god can you please just take Jaden away from the planet it's not like 
<laughs> it's not like I'm saying that. I wish Jaden the best. What's done is done. We're not going to be hanging out and posting pictures to my Instagram anytime soon. I don't know why this drama keeps, you know, coming back every few months. And I am honestly sick of the... <laughs> of the few videos that i've seen and people not knowing the full story so i'm just like you know what i'm gonna just address everything right now so there it is i am never talking about this again this is it fiend